we're on, I guess. Okay, I'm going to answer some comments. Today is November, no, December the 7th, 2009. Okay, I just got some comments on the video I just uploaded. This was on Nancy Today, both of them the crafts. Scratch. Um, little tiny said so looks like a big project. Yes, I guess it is a big project. But Bo is amazing. Bo is Virginia's husband from Germany. Like, they just, she knows how to do everything. Um, Little Tiny also said, nice to see them again. Looks like you're having some nice visiting. Any videos of your mom from your trip? No, my mom, we, we aren't going to um, put my mom on YouTube. That would not be, that would be an invasion of her privacy. Um, Little Tiny, oh, she's waving to Myron, who's looking at the, Kro to Nancy today, Kroger man. He's a nice, he's a nice guy. Okay, now I gotta move down here. Oh, and Emily um, wanted me to become a fan of something on Facebook. I don't do those things. I don't get into those Facebook groups because you have to share everything with them. Again, and it's bad enough to have to share everything with Facebook. That's very invasive into your personal privacy, your, all your details. So, um... I don't add any applications, so I also don't, um, if people send me flowers and farm animals and all those applications that you can add, I just don't do them, I'm sorry. I love you anyway, but I don't do them. Okay, and somebody said about how to make pancakes, somebody said that I'm starting to freak them out because I'm making a family look bad. Well, you know? That's the way it goes. That's who I am, and I don't think the family looks any worse because of who their mom is. Um, let's see. Make icing sugar. Techno Freak 37 said about making icing sugar. Thank you very much, Nancy. Well, you're welcome. I think that you should have added, I should have added a little bit of cornstarch to the sugar. I think you just add a tablespoon to is it a cup of icing sugar? Or a spoon of Okay. Dean Emily said about the science behind these farms. Now it's so beautiful. Yes, now is a lovely kitty. He didn't used to be so beautiful. He kind of looked silly dull. And there was this good kind of cat food at the grocery store. It wasn't really well, it was a little more than the other cat food. It wasn't it certainly wasn't the nine dollar ninety nine a box. It was a, a plastic president's choice. But anyway, and it was it made him shine. Okay. Um, I'm trying to find the next one. Oh, I don't know. V I A Y A D I G subscribed. Hello, welcome. Find yourself a mug. Um, interesting facts about trains. Indeed, X D J. Indeed, X X said. The thread monitors functions such as the brake line pressure and accidental separation of the train using a motion sensor, functions that would have been monitored by a crew in the caboose. Oh, the thread. I guess that's a caboose thing. The thread transmits the data via a telemetry link to the head of the train device, HDTD, in the locomotive. So that's what that little box at the end of the train. That was on interesting facts about trains. Um, oh, did you know that Canadian bacon, in the United States they call it Canadian bacon, but really it's just back bacon in Canada. I tried in Canada to find Canadian bacon. It's not the same. It's back bacon. Okay. Um, about Berkshire Hills train. Nancy's rail fanning, and I'll share a few things with you to clear things up. The clicking noise that the train is making is the air compressor as it builds up 
air pressure. Some is released so not too much is built up. Also go for the lines that run between the cars. Both are the air lines for the brakes. No hydraulics. And with the engines facing different ways, well, that's done so that if they need to go the other way, they can use the other one, since you can't just turn a train around anyway. Oops, gotta be down lower on that one. Tab. Down on that. So thank you very much, XXDJ, indeed, XX. You must know a lot about trains. Okay, we're gonna keep going here. The Green Vegan has made a comment on Nancy's a motivational movement class. So much fun. I do it all the time. I was dancing with you, but you could not see me. You're the greatest, Nancy. Love from the West Coast. Thank you. Coconut Baby said about, I made a comment on messes in our parents' privacy. She made a comment on my video that said messes in our parents' privacy. Hi, Nancy. I like what you said about honoring your parents. It's so true. Shame on that girl for doing that to her parents. Now, this was, I read, I watched the video where a teenager um, went through her parents' house and showed the piles of stuff. I guess it was a hoarder. But anyway, I mean, it was on the hoarders. Anyway, and I thought it was just really invasive that she should say all these terrible things about her parents who raised her and who sacrificed so much for her and True, their house was not the way she would want her house to be, and maybe other people don't have houses like that, but it's not its not a child's right to invade them. Um, <clears throat> Hi, Nancy. I like what you said about honoring your parents. It's so true. Shame on that girl for doing that to her parents. The Bible says in Exodus 20, 12, Honor thy father and thy mother, that thy days may be long upon the land, which the Lord thy God giveth me thee. And repeats it again in Deuteronomy 5:16. So it seems to say, if you don't honor your parents, your life is shortened. So children need to take heed of that. When my daughter disrespects me, I quote that scripture. Oops, you just lost ten. Just lost years on your life. Um, I like that scripture, and I make fun. It says, Honor thy father and thy mother, that thy days may be long in the land, which the Lord thy God giveth thee. Well, if your children are not nice to their parents, you know, some parents have said, I brought you into this world and I can take you out. Of course, that would be very bad. But I kind of think that that's how come the children's days may be long. <laughs> I know. How long do I have on here? Oh, that's 8.3. This thing is turned off. I'm losing my E. Thanks <coughs> because it uploads really quickly. Planet Jill has commented on my profile. And Nancy, I think of you every day. I keep you in my prayers. Take care. We miss you, Jill Oregon. Thank you very much, Jill. I really miss you guys. My life is so different. I'm in Georgia, taking care of my mom. <coughs> and everything that's normal to me is no longer normal to me. I love it. I love doing this. But it's just not, well, you know, change is change. You and Emily made a comment on sawing up the coffee table. Toasty buns. Oh, well. I think. I think probably somebody got to piss with this thing. Flying up the coffee table. Did you know that we had this huge coffee table and it was just in the way? So Willem and I decided to saw it up. He saw it and I cheered. Um, Dean and Emily also made a comment on Nancy today. Willem plays the bells. Yeah. Ha 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 ha. I love it. That was fun. And we're having Christmas. Uh, one day in April. I just. I mean, I haven't taken the tree down yet because it, to me the tree is a winter thing. It just stays up on me. Um, Dean Emily also made a comment on Nancy today. I love you guys. You're just wonderful to me. Well, that's what it says to you guys. The two of you are so wonderful together. My thank you. It must have been about women. And then, easy way to sterilize jars for canning. She said about that. You are adorable. And thank goodness for the wonders of the internet. I like being adorable, that's nice. Dina Emily also commented on why you need to close doors, put pictures on wall. Ah.